Hello everyone. Welcome to this video lesson. In this video lesson, we would like to talk about the sign convention. That how do you consider the distances? And we also talk about what is focal length, whose focal length shall be treated like positive, and whose focal length shall be treated like negative. First of all, let us talk about sign convention. Say, whenever there is a spherical lens, there should be a convex lens or a con uh, spherical mirror, concave mirror or a convex mirror. This is what I have taken is a concave mirror because concave side is exposed to light, left side. The center of the mirror is generally called pole. The center of the sphere is called center of curvature line passing to the center of curvature under the pole is called as principal axis while we are measuring the values in any of this spherical mirror we start measuring everything from the pole so what we have to say is pole is the reference point to measure any distance whether it may be object distance or image distance focal length whatever it may be so what's the meaning of this is all the distances are measured from the pole itself all the distances are measured from the pole so for example if i had an object somewhere on the left side light rays are falling like this, like this object is not seen in the diagram because we are assuming like object is at a very far distance now this light rays which are parallel to the principal axis are also called something like parallel paraxial light rays now this light rays gets reflected back this light ray also get reflected back this reflected light rays comes and meet at a particular point the point where do they meet is called as principal focus so this point is called principal focus so what do you mean by a principal focus is the meeting point of reflected light rays where incident light rays are parallel or called something like paraxial that means parallel to the axial line now the distance between pole and the principal focus and be careful while you are measuring the distance we shall not start measuring from the principal focus rather we shall measure from the pole itself because pole is a reference point this distance is called CDF or else PF is called something like focal length. The distance between pole and the principal focus. is called focal length to understand which has to be treated like positive which has to be treated like negative let us take a convex mirror also what i have taken is a concave mirror now let us consider a convex mirror also this is the convex mirror this is the pole of the mirror 
this is the principal axis whereas this is the center of curvature let us consider some light rays these light rays are paraxial light rays parallel to principal axis these light rays after striking on the convex mirror surface reflects back they diverge i have noticed that they are diverging so where do you see the image of the object who is already at a very long distance these light rays are diverging they are not going to come go and meet at a particular place where image is seen so the eye who is trying to see this uh, image what it will do is it will extend this diverging light rays in the reverse direction you can see these two diverging light rays meet at a particular point where do you see the image where it, it appears like there's an image that's why this image is called something like virtual image as already it is explained in the previous video lesson also so this image is virtual because light rays are not actually met but the photographic camera or else the eye has extended them in the reverse direction and visualized the image this image is a real image because light rays are actually getting reflected and meeting at this particular point in this case also the distance between pole and this uh, extended light rays meet at a particular point which is called as principal focus the distance between the pole and the principal focus it also is called something like focal length so you have noticed that focal length in this case is measured from the pole towards the left here so the first sign convention that we need to follow is all the distances are measured from the pole right the second sign convention the point the important point of the sign convention is if any distance is measured in the direction of the incident line it has to be treated as positive similarly any distance measured against the direction of incident light shall be treated as a negative what is the meaning of this try to understand see this is the direction of incident light any distance measured in that direction shall be treated like positive but if you look at the focal length how it is measured from the pole to the principal focus it is measured in this direction so you might have noticed here in the case of a concave mirror f is measured against the direction of incident light against the direction of the incident light incident light is from left to right whereas f is from right to left whereas in this case see the case of a convex mirror this is convex mirror this is the direction of incident light from left to right and the focal length is also measured from pole to the principal focus which is also from left to right so in this case f is measured in the direction of incident light itself in the direction of incident light so the distance measured in the direction of the incident light shall be treated like a positive therefore this focal length f of a convex mirror is treated as positive this focal length f of concave mirror is treated as negative so conventionally focal length of the 
convex mirror is treated as positive concave mirror is treated as negative because of this reason this is a standard convention and we shall follow this convention in all the cases there is another point that we can say regarding this sign convention this is one point another another point is heights measured on the principal axis above the axis see for example this if this is the principal axis if this is the height above the principal axis it has to be treated like positive Suppose if there is a height that is measured below the principal axis is treated like negative. So if we call this as H1, we call this as H2. So above the axis is positive, horizontal axis or the principal axis. Below the principal axis, the height measured H is negative so this is a positive height this is a negative height this so this is the sign convention and this is the way of defining focal lengths facing on this sign convention focal length of a convex mirror is positive focal length of a concave mirror is negative focal length is the distance between pole and the principal focus of a given mirror thank you for watching keep coming back for more and more video lessons Thank you.